Good day guys, my name is Mahulen and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am on my way to a small town called Pine Creek in Northern Territory, Australia. Pine Creek is having a well-known history for more than 200 years and it is called as one of the historical towns in Northern Territory, Australia. There are many historical places to visit in this small town and it is being as one of the very important places for the tourists in Northern Territory during dry season. So, in today's video, we are going to see what's special about this town and what are the things we can see in this town. If you guys are new to this channel, please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the bell icon. And without further delay, let's jump into the video. This is Stuart Highway, which is the fastest highway in Australia. This highway connects two major cities, Darwin and Port Augusta in Australia. When you see along this highway, this one is the welcome boat for Pine Creek Town. It is an attractive one and shows what activities we can do in this town. Oh guys, it is nearly 40 degrees today in Pine Creek and when you look at me carefully, you can see few flies are flying around me. You can experience this when you go out to remote Australia in a very hot day. I need to drive another 500 meters and we will be in Pine Creek town. Alright guys, we are here in this town. Let's walk around and see what we can see in this town. Look at here, there is a small church in this town. When you see opposite to the church, you can see a windmill. Let's go near and have a look. On our way, you can see two old cylinders placed here. I reckon they would have been used to store oil or gas back in early days. Look at the information about this windmill guys. They opened this place which is called as Water Gardens in 1993 and they installed this windmill here. This one is so old now and rusted all over. I would say this windmill looks very beautiful guys. There is also a kind of small park in this town. Let's see this one. This one looks like a pond guys. I don't think anyone maintains this one and it is full of rubbish and looks dirty. You can also see few flowering plants in this park. Look at this structure which is made from metal sheets and claddings. This one looks like a very old building. Let's go near to that and see what is that one. Look at this information board guys. It is nearly faded fully. What I can see is a word bakery and an year 1889. I reckon it should be a bakery built in 1889. It is very old now, all the roof sheets and claddings are rusted and they don't use this anymore. But it is for display for the tourist. You can see an old museum here in this Pine Creek town, but it is unfortunately closed now. This one here is a repeater station. It is said that this one was prefabricated in England and then shipped to Australia and erected in 1889. You can find some more information about this place below. You can also see some tools and equipment used for mining here. There is a cylinder and also a small mine cart. They look very old. When you look the other side, you can see two big oil tanks. They are also in damaged condition and they are old too. Now, we are at a place called as Pine Creek Museum and Railway Station. You can see a very old crane here. And when you see the other side, 
you can see an open compartment of a train. This one is called as Railway Museum, but unfortunately this one is also closed now. You can see a weighing machine outside. This one was a post office in Pine Creek and it was used from 1889 to 1946. This is the ticket counter for the railway station back in the days. You can see a train here, NF5 locomotive. It is said that it was fabricated in 1877 and brought to Darwin, Australia in 1915. This is that train guys. It is a historical train and well secured inside a locked cage. It looks historical and beautiful. You can see the house of railway station master here. It is said that this one was built in 1889. It is appreciable that they are keeping all the old historical buildings securely as a place of visit for tourists. Pine Creek Town is having a long history of gold mining. The information about gold mining is mentioned on this board here. This one is a steam equipment used during gold mining. I reckon they would have mined a lot of gold using this equipment and now it is a historical equipment being displayed for visitors. You can see there is a place called Miners Park. Let's go and have a look. The mining history of South Alligator River in Northern Territory is mentioned here guys. They have done mining from 1922 to 1984. You can see few information indicated here with the year. It is indicated the gold was discovered in 1871. In 1920, Mundogi Hill and Jambalba fields were discovered. It is also mentioned that uranium was discovered in 1953. There are a lot of information mentioned in this place about mining in Pine Creek and surrounding areas. Each board here describes a special event happened in a particular period. You can have a clear look guys. Look at this board. There are some information about roll crushers and they were used in a mine site. There are a few tools and machineries displayed here which were used in the ancient mining industry. You can see a mining locomotive which was used in mining industry to carry mined minerals and metals. You can see a big tower here. This was also used for mining industry. There are also few cylinders in this place. Information about each machinery or tool is mentioned on the information board in front of them. There are various other machineries and equipments which were used in the mining industry in Pine Creek were displayed here for the tourists and visitors. That is the place where all the tools and machineries are guys. Now we came past them and you can see few other tools here. There is also a very old railway bridge here guys. 
all the trains which traveled in and out of this Pine Creek railway station would have gone over this bridge only. Alright guys, that is the end of this video. I hope you guys would have enjoyed this video and if you did so, please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the bell icon. I will see you all in another beautiful episode. Till then, thanks for watching and cheers.